In tonight's Project Earth, climate change is threatening our planet's biodiversity. One report reveals up to a million species are threatened with extinction. Now, a new Stanford analysis warns it's worse than that. Entire groups of animals are actually vanishing. But in California, a small endangered fox is teaching us a lesson not to give up. Ann McEvick reports. Early in the morning, as the sun rises at Cal State University Bakersfield, it's pretty quiet, just a few folks out walking. But when night falls, it gets a little wild. Researchers yeah. puncture a can of cat food, securing it to the ground, and overnight, a camera records the action. The skunks and opossums are no big surprise, but these guys are the San Joaquin kit fox. They're an endangered species. I think we were all very surprised uh, to see kit foxes doing so well just in urban areas. State biologist Abby Gwynn, she said since the late 60s, the number of San Joaquin kit foxes has dramatically declined, in part due to habitat loss. Now, climate change threatens them even more. But as you can see on this recent video, the foxes are multiplying like crazy. It seems like they really like school campuses. <laughs> for better or for worse, CSUB, our campus, seems to be a little kit fox factory. Dr. Lucas Hall is a conservation biologist at the university. The scientist and his team made an eye-opening discovery. The kit fox is sharing burrow space with other wild animals, including one of their favorite foods, the California ground squirrel. It is kind of surprising when you think that here on campus, you know, we have ground squirrels, but we have evidence using kit fox burrows. Well, you know, there's cats that are using those burrows, opossums, raccoons, skunks. It's just, it's, it's crazy cool. But this crazy cool roommate situation has created an unusual dilemma. The number of squirrels has exploded and they're ripping up the landscape. The ground staff decided to fumigate what they thought were squirrel dens. That plan left some students fuming. They didn't really know which were uh, squirrel dens or kid fox dens. We are the only university that has endangered San Joaquin kit foxes that live on it. Biology students Francisco Ponce and Megan Boozer are charter members of the San Joaquin Kit Fox Society. On campus, the society has gathered nearly 2,000 signatures to stop the fumigation. The university has since discontinued the program and proclaimed its unwavering support for the endangered fox. It's exciting. It's not, it's not doom and gloom. It's like, oh, wow, we could really do a lot. Biodiversity is one of the greatest weapons to fight the impacts of climate change. The campus is now home to 70 kit fox dens with 37 foxes at last count. There's hope that if we do if we do the right thing now and we work together, we can make a difference. Dr. Hall is inspired to see the next generation get involved. The decisions that we make now are not decisions that we have to live with. They're decisions that the next generation has to live with. As we all try to outfox the impacts of a warming planet. The university is now forming an ecosystem council to bolster and coordinate sustainability efforts on the campus.